Alrighty, guys. New game. Let's do this. So far, with the outdated graphics drivers, no problem yet that I can tell. They did say there's known issues. <laughs> we'll see. Three days ago, Truman Zanotto, the grand head of the Psychonauts, was kidnapped. Is that too loud? Yesterday, with my help, the Psychonauts rescued Truman from the underwater lair of Dr. Lobato. But trust me, there's no way Lobato is working alone. Today, we're on a mission. Find out who hired Dr. Lobato to kidnap Truman Zanotto. My name is Raz, and today is my first official day on the job. Look at all those cubicles. <laughs> Was it the milk man? I love that chapter in the first game. My milk is delicious. <laughs> I love how he types, just pecking. Welcome to the Everything cycle. Everything okay in here, Raz? Oh, <laughs> hey, Lily. Yeah, I don't know. It's just... I've dreamed about working at Psychonauts headquarters all my life. I just thought it would be more... You know? Come on! We're going to be late for the morale corral! That's cute. <laughs> morale corral? Yeah, I have a feeling it might be slightly too loud. And that's how we managed to raise profits... Uh, 900% this quarter. That's right. Thank you. And that brings us to our next topic. Uh, Sasha, still have the talking turtle? Maury. Sorry, I just like the clapping. <laughs> Aw. It's now time to give out the award for Employee of the Year. The prize for this year's award is an all-expenses-paid tropical vacation. Ooh, Ooh, did we win? Oh, I hope it's me. The winner of this award may be one of our newest members, huh? but he's also one of our most improved. Congratulations to... Caligosto Loboto! Whoa! That's not us. Way to go, Cal. You're gonna love this vacation package. I'm jealous. I think that was the bad guy in the last I, one. I've never won anything. Or been on a vacation. I don't have to go on a boat, do I? No, darling. Woo! All you need to do is get this vacation request approved by your supervisor. What? Just a formality. You just need to get this form signed by your boss. My boss? Yes, darling. Or you could just tell us who your boss is and we could... No! Maybe he doesn't want this tropical vacation after all. He's like, I'll take it. In fact, I want it. I'm employee of the year. Yes, you are, darling. Now off you go. Get that form signed by your boss. <laughs> the person I love it. who hired you. The person you work for. Okay. Does he even have a boss? Or I take that vacation myself. Rasputin? I'm on him. Keep up with him, Raz, and he'll lead you straight to his boss. Oh, we're tricking him. Okay, I got, I got it. I got it. We'll try to head him off. Be careful, darling. Okay, let me just turn it down ever so slightly. I have a feeling that might be a little bit overpowering. There we go. Let me know how that is. I'm going to use a controller for this game because there is a lot of platforming. Stay close to him, Raz. But don't freak him out. So don't get too close. Remember to act casual. I am acting casual. What's that? I said I love casual Friday. Am I right? Mm -hmm. We don't. The tooth is loose. So lose him, Raz. We don't really have a. Um... Casual Friday at my work. We're just gonna. Oh crap! Uh oh. What is it? I think he suspects something. He's taking countermeasures. Just remember your basic. This is kind of business casual right. all the time. 
Oh, we can punch him. Nice. Are you following me? Of course not. You are following me. This was all a trick. Uh oh. I'm not employee of the. Year. Screwed up. I'm the greatest dentist of our century. Green banana. How's it going? All agents, the tooth has gone bad. Repeat, the tooth has gone bad. Maintain pursuit, Rasputin. We oh, we have a double jump, to too. Roger. Actually, Ring Banana, you're kind of perfectly Looking on time. We just well, started a brand new game. Me. Whoa, look at this room. It's stretching. Why I can't catch him. So <laughs> <laughs> That's cool. I don't think you understand the gravity of the situation you're in. <laughs> Let's see, press A to jump to the ledge Watch above. Out. There we go. Yeah, so we just hey, finished the medium, and now we're way. starting this one. Oh. So, you are perfectly on time for the brand new game. Oh, we can do wall jumps too. Nice. <laughs> now we're upside down. Ouch. No time for small talk, soldier. The enemy is on the move. But we got him cornered this way. Quick. Look how fast he is. Hurry. Can't let him shake us. I don't know if I can now, run any faster. Before the procedure, Whoa. it's very important that we clean out your dentist site. You don't want any dirty. Go away. Ah! Oh no. Uh oh. We're gonna get crushed. Press L in any direction and B to dodge. Oh crap, there's still stuff falling. Oh, I think I just need to look at the um, shadows. Stand down, soldier! I can't lift that tooth. There's a door up there. We just need to make some sort of ladder or stairs. There we go. Lots of figments of Lobato's imagination in here. Figments? What is that? Oh, we'll see in a little bit, OJ. So, Ring Banana, Psychonauts. This is actually the sequel. Although I don't know how much you need to really know about the first game to play this one. But essentially, your character is like was enrolled in this like school program to like learn how to be a psychic, in which you go into people's brains and they'll have different kinds of trauma or problems that you go in there and you get to see it throughout like a level and you try to fix it, help them out with whatever they're scared of, whatever's bothering them, if they're depressed or whatever. And uh, right now we're in the middle of trying to uh, trick this enemy into showing us who his boss is because he was the bad guy in the previous one but we know that he's working for somebody so we're trying to find out who he's working for so figments of the imagination are littered all over your mental worlds your rank will increase for every 100 you collect it's kind of like a puzzle platform game they're really fun when you see a figment suck it up soldier I loved the first game. This is like 20 years ago that it came out, and this one's been getting good reviews. It just came out yesterday. Oh yeah, there's all kinds of these things. Got okay, let's ideas? talk to this guy. Coach, there were no teeth in Sasha's plan. That's what I told him. But he's all no weapons, Molly. <laughs> no teeth? That was a big tooth. Right, right in. It would be really cool if somebody... I mean, it's kind of like a therapist, essentially, but... Uh, oh, that's gross. Look at that missing tooth. I don't like it. Oh, I bet we, we can probably... do some dental work of our own. I bet we can put that tooth there, huh? There we go. Great job following orders, Private. You go on ahead. I'll take up the rear guard. So, can I jump up to that? Nice. I thought the big tooth was upsetting. Well... Soldier through, Private. Unzip that dental door. <laughs> These teeth are kind of creepy. <laughs> Good job, Soldier. What's that light? Uh oh. Zip it back up again. Zip it. Ah! Yeah. Now the that your cap? cap is clean, oh. let's check out those choppers. Hmm. If I didn't know better, I'd swear this place had gremlins. I love the no characters problem. in this game. I'm 
sure I can do this in the dark. Uh... <laughs> Coach, this room is definitely not in Sasha's plan. In fact, I think it's a trap. No. That's just a sensor. A sensor? <laughs> what? Everybody has those. You live in your mind and stamp out things that don't belong. Like us. us. You handle this one. I'll find a way out. <laughs> See ya. What is up, Christian? Actually, I don't think we found a box in the last game, but we'll probably find one in this stream. I gotta remember the controls. B is dodge. Got him. No. Oh, they keep spawning. No. Oh, I can grab objects and hit them. That's pretty sweet. No. I like how they say no, no. Got him. Just have to do your thing with the dental door here. Ugh. I can't even look at it. They're kind of gross. Should try to get that sorted. Um, yeah. So the first game Christian came out like in the early 2000s. So this is like 20 years later. We're finally getting a sequel. Emotional baggage. Everyone has emotional baggage that needs to be sorted. Very true. You can help out by finding that this bag's lost tag. Every five you reunite will grant a rank. Sweet, there's all kinds of collectibles. <laughs> right, right in, stun lock them. Oh, there's another one of these guys. Oh, there's a few of these I should grab first. And then, why is this thing all green? It looks like there could be something there. Oh, is that healing? I think that might be healing. <laughs> Emotional baggage, right? Wait, what movie is that from, OJ? I don't think I know that one. Okay, so it looks like if you see something that's kind of glowing green, you get uh, healing out of it. That's a cool poster, or painting. Oh, I see some goodies over here. Oh, Frodo, I got it, yeah. Man, I haven't watched Lord of the Rings in so long. We just got a new television not too long ago and surround sound system. I think it might be time to uh, watch that again. These things are too far apart for me to double jump. I got stuck behind there. Oh, can I make it up there? Oh, just barely. Mm, nothing up there. I think we got everything. Oh, there's a tag. Yes, got the Sweet. Tag. Reunite this tag with its companion, emotional baggage, to help sort it out. I was curious, OJ, which is your favorite of all three of the Lord of the Rings movies? And I'm curious to see what the Amazon series is going to be like. I don't know too much about it. We can't get through the glass. Oh, there's the bag. Oh, he's so happy. Sweet. All right, we tagged him. We probably use that to unlock something later on. I'm not sure. Look at that painting of the woman in there. That's funny. I think, I think we did everything here. I think we're good to go. Hey, see what you can find that way. See you on the other side. What's kind of funny, in the medium, there was these weird fleshy doors you had to cut through with like a, a scalpel or that knife. Looks like some sort of conference Those teeth kind of here. remind me of that. Rasputin, is that you? I need... I'm coming, Sasha. <laughs> Oh, you actually like the Hobbit movies more. Nice. You felt the pacing was better and never felt too overwhelming plot-wise. Probably because they weren't trying to cram so much information into just three movies. So it was like a smaller, just a single book. Careful. It's a oh. 
Here's the hat box tag. So they could do a lot better Someone job to spread it out, him. I guess. He couldn't. Where is this guy? I hear him getting tortured, but I can't this find himself. him. Oof. Oh, there he is. Oh, jeez. Um, right bumper to blast concentrated energy. Thank you, there we Please, go. Let's get clear of this aggressive uvula. Sasha, how is Lobato breaking through the office construct? He couldn't be doing this on his own. He must be getting help from someone even more sinister. So many teeth in this level. Get ready, Rasputin. Oh, nice. How much can I do this? I think I have infinite blasts. I just have to wait for it to recharge. Keep moving forward, Rasputin. Ah. Sasha! Uh-oh. I ooh, I've got the situation on our oh, control. Ah. Yeah, I don't think just you do. Find us a way out of here quickly. Yeah, don't bother with them, little mooks. You want to go for the gold. You got to grab the big boys. Help me carry this one, will you, Frankie? Anybody have gold teeth or gold caps? Oh, I'm playing. Where did my buddy go? Okay, let's unlock these. <laughs> oh, gee, that's pretty good. Indentured. But on I wonder, am I supposed to shoot that down? There we go. I love the art style and voice acting and everything in these games. Oh, I can't quite reach that one, though. Maybe I can jump down from here? Oh, there we go. Cool, I think that was it. Office directory, instead of storage, is just rage. Break down, not break room, boss, and trap. Oh, here's his mouth. Did you even brush before you came in here today? Honestly, it's a mess in there. I need to go to the here, dentist. It's been a long time. Ah! I've been avoiding it ever since Everything COVID started. That doesn't belong. Oh, we're back here again? Oh, no. Not back in the trap. Trap? Coach? Coach, where'd he go? Oh, well, that's a good sign. What is it? Regret. That is a regret. If Lobato has regrets, then maybe there's a way we can still get to him. Let's get out of here and find Lobato. I love how they tie, like, uh, actual things with your Sasha? mind into the story. Are regrets dangerous? Oh, yes, extremely. Take care of that one, will you, while I find an exit? So right trigger to lock onto him. Oh, there we go. Mental energy. Brains represent the strength of Raz's connection to the mental world. When mental energy is depleted, he will be reset to his last mental checkpoint. Oh, and we got these sensors coming too. Oh, I actually got hurt. I needed that. No. You know, he does a pretty good job of auto-aiming without me locking onto him. Good job, Rasputin. Nice. Unfortunately, I can't find a way out of here anywhere. Uh, Sasha? How long has that golden door been there? Golden what? Did somebody say gold? Frankie, here's a chance for <laughs> revenge! Oh, not these guys. I'll keep looking. Ooh, do I have to kill him at a certain spot to access that door? There he is, or do I just take it out anywhere? Has anybody ever seen Psychonauts before? Gotcha. Or is this your They're first time? At us. Frankie! Frankie! Not again! I'm coming to see you, ma! Jeez! Rasputin, you see what you can find through that door. I'm going to stay here and attempt to repair my construct. We almost killed him. Okay, where's my health at? Not sure. I want to see if I have full health. Nah, I think we're good. Maybe it doesn't show my health if I'm at full health. So you played the original back in the day, but it's been a long time since you even thought about it. 
Tajay, same. Although I guess I, I thought about it more when I played the VR game about three or four years ago, which I also really liked. It was very different from this. It was all first person. You just kind of teleported from place to place and it was like a puzzle game. But uh, yeah, I love the original back in the day. I love how destructive everything is too. Oh, looks like there's something back here. Memory Vault. Some minds try to protect themselves by locking memories away in vaults. Chase them down and bust them open to reveal the repressed memories inside. Oh, I see it back there. Hey, that's one of Dr. Lobato's vaults. I should try to catch it. Could we hide that again? Oh, you just have to beat the crap out of it. Oh, we got the repressed memory. Enhancement under the sea. This is cool. You get like a little uh, slideshow of them. Tajay, did you have any interest in getting a VR headset at any time? Got a passport map and a ton of cash. Outpost, Charlie Psycho Delta, CPD. Doing something with the fish? Turning them into fish people? Playing poker with them? <laughs> All right, he's learning to enhance these fish. Okay, let's grab all these. I think that's it in there. Oh, now we have to go down that door. So you'd love to get one, but if I did and you have a good one and it's hard to justify spending more on a headset that you just spent on your car. That, yeah, that Valve Index is still ridiculous. I'm kind of surprised it's never dropped in price. It's still $1,000. Honestly, for anyone interested, because you never know how much you're really going to get into it. If you don't mind tying your Facebook account to it, which unfortunately is the only way to use them, I'd recommend the Oculus headsets. They're pretty fantastic. I actually used, my wife has the original Quest. We used it when we visited my parents and played some Half-Life Alex, streaming through the computer and some other stuff. It works great. Oh, that's trippy going through the door like that. Oh, this is not getting any better. Raz! Is that you? Come down here! Lily, I'm coming! <laughs> this is clever. Oh, that loose lips sink drips. Like when you have to spit in the sink. And American Luigi, how are you doing, dude? Welcome to the stream. Cool name, by the way. <laughs> Luigi's awesome. We just had the year of Luigi not too long ago, right? Oh crap, what's happening? Hurry up, Raz. Oh, we're moving fast. And I think we just got spit out. Still got that water phobia, huh? It's huge. It's not a phobia, it's a curse. Back in Grulovia, my whole family was cursed to die in water. And Yeah, yeah, super sad. Look at these posters. I think someone else planted these in Lobato's mind to intimidate him. And make sure he didn't tell us who hired him to kidnap your dad. Did you guys hear Let's that? Let's get rid of them. Maybe it'll help. Help me burn these posters, Raz. It's funny. The posters are all about protecting his boss. Don't be a rat. Don't snitch. Shh. Loose lips, that kind of thing. I tried moving my coffee cup. And it made this loud screeching sound on the coaster. It's hard to reproduce. It was weird. Um, hold left bumper to charge the psychokinesis and then release to set things on fire. Okay, I've never tried the left bumper yet. Oh, yes, I'll check that out, OJ. See if it uh, sounds like the same. That's pretty cool. Thank you for sharing that. Oh, I think I have to be real close to them. There we go. Oh, if I jump up, I can kind of get m multiple at the same time. <laughs> Only pigs squeal. Pigs in Cartman, right? Ooh, looks like you found an even bigger room. I'm gonna catch up to Lobato. Okay, I'll catch up after I make sure these posters are all burnt. Ooh, I got all four of them at once. Um, and Luigi, have you played this game before, or the other Psychonauts game? Yep. reach those other ones too. Oh, there we go. How do I get up there? 
Oh, maybe I can use my telekinesis to bring him down? No. I can't quite jump up that high. Oh, there's another way to go here. Maybe I don't have to take all of them out. Just a bunch. We're not here to hurt you. We just want to know who hired you to kidnap Truman's Oh, he's Zanotto. talking right there. <laughs> Why can't you just let it go? Oh, swell. That ends well. Okay, let's get this one. Oh, it's gonna drop. That was close. Let's try to get a few over here without killing myself. We're definitely gonna need the death counter in this game, I'm sure. But so far, it's still zero. Amazing. Do I burn this one too? I don't know if I can burn this. Oh, I think we can. Not talking to him again. What's oh, these other ones yep. don't actually drop, just certain ones. Oh, I see something behind there. What is this? Oh, it's one of the duffel bags. <laughs> do I have the tag for it? I do. I don't think any tag works with any duffel bag. They have to be the matching color. Nothing up there. Let's keep going. Oh, something right above me. I bet there's something behind here, too. Yup. Anything in the water? Oh, there's no way I can get to those things. I doubt you need to burn all of them. I'm going to try to get it. Oh, I'm just close enough. Okay, I just have to keep jumping. I can't try to burn those. I love double jumps in games. The boss. Here's where his boss is hiding. I think I hear some emotional baggage nearby. Oh, there is a duffel bag up here. I need the purse tag here. Yep. Oh, so am I missing a green tag somewhere? Hmm. I'm not sure where I might have missed that. Maybe I missed like a secret exit or something? Cool burning all these. Oh yeah, I hear it, but can't do anything about it. Oh, there's something right here. Is that a switch? Can't tell what that is. Oh no, it's like a little tool or something. Hmm. Yeah, I must have missed a tag somewhere. Unless there's something behind one of these big posters, like another exit. Doesn't look like it, though. Okay, let's go ahead and burn this one. Whoa. Was that you screaming? I mean, it's a hell of a hook. Matter. Listen, we all have our doubts and regrets, but it's too late to turn back now. Understand? What we have to do now is finish the extraction. Oh, no, thank you. Lily, I think Lobato is starting to have doubts. Duh, they're right over there. Oh, we haven't seen these yet. Holds you back. Luckily, they're highly flammable. You take care of them while I find a way out, okay? <laughs> I love how she says that. Okay, so I have to let it get close and then blast it with this, huh? Oh, crap. I got too close. 
Citanium. Citanium is a psychoreactive material used by psychonauts as currency. Save it up to buy some useful stuff later. Oh, that's pretty sweet. All right. No. Can I burn these guys too? Yeah, it doesn't seem to do a ton of damage though. Although they do run around stunned, so that's kind of cool. Got it. A Psy Pop. This brain candy will restore some of your mental energy. Hold down to gobble up Psy Pop. Now, I thought my mental energy just kind of comes back automatically, but I'm not entirely sure now. Oh, I got two of them for one. Oh, there's that guy too. Shoot him down. Burn both of these guys. Nice. Get away from me, you scary little girl! Think we should burn it? Oh, you haven't changed, have you? Come on, <laughs> just tell us who hired you to kidnap my dad. Oh, this is really personal for you, isn't it? You better believe it is. Well, I'm sorry if you were offended. That does it. I'm burning this guy. Wait, wait. I'll tell you. Uh... Yes? The person who hired me... Yes? ...was no one. No one hired me because I didn't do anything! Oh, brother. Well, not on purpose, at least. It was an accident! You've got to be kidding me. Your father got lost. Okay, let's keep looking. ...up in the rhombus of ruin on accident. Uh, and I was just trying to help a friend for me you to come save him. Hmm, nice nothing try. back here. Oh, we actually get the currency, though, by breaking boxes. So I gotta make sure I do that as much as possible. Oh, wait, we've been here before. It just looked a bit different than last time. Okay, so I am gonna have to burn that thing, I'm sure, but let's explore just a little bit more. I feel like it's easy to miss tags and things like that in this game. We came from up there, but what's over on this side? It looks like just a dead end. I like the kind of almost James Bond-esque spy movie music. Okay, we'll burn this guy. Oh! I think I just did. <laughs> That's great. Oh, Luigi, thank you for the follow, dude. Mia? Yes, darling? Nothing. Did you forget everything I taught you about levitation, Rasputin? It's been a long time. No. Your thoughts can lift you up if you focus. Better mm. hurry before we hit the ground. Uh, hold left trigger while falling to glide. Now let's get out of here. The nice. No more yes. falling damage. Wait, help Lobato. Someone really did a number on that poor thing. I think he wants to tell us who hired him, but he's terrified. Let's find him and help him. So it's saying to get maximum distance, jump and hold it, then do a double jump, and then hold left trigger to glide. Okay. Before I do that, is there anything down here? for some secrets. Doesn't look like it. Yeah, Luigi, have you played any of these games before? Either the first one, this one, or even the VR game? Okay, I gotta time that just right. Here it comes. Let's go. Oh, jeez. I didn't think I was gonna make that. Can I reach that one? I think we need to go to that other side. I don't think there's any way to jump from here. Updrafts lift you higher and extend your glide time. Sweet. Oh, what about that one? Oh, maybe I can... 
Maybe I can hit that updraft, turn around, and reach that. Let's try that out. Try to immediately turn back. Oh, I think we're gonna make it. Just barely. You got the first tag. Sweet. Oh, so you played the first one this summer, and you only beat it after you learned they were making a second one. Oh, right on. Yeah, sometimes you want to catch up right before the new one, right? I played the first one when it first came out, so like practically 20 years ago or so. I forget what year it came out, like 2003 or something, but loved it. I even played the VR game just a few years ago. Okay, I'm going to go back here, and now let's use that again. I got to get that other butterfly thing right there. Oh, crap. What happened? <laughs> okay, that was my first death. I gotta reset the death counter from the last game we were playing. Let me go ahead and fix that. Here. Oh, 2005. There we go. So not 20 years ago, like 16 years ago. Feels like 20 years. Jeez. Let me go ahead and reset my death counter. And we got our first death of the game. <laughs> Resume. Okay, I was holding the left trigger. I wonder if I ran out of juice. Maybe it takes a minute to refresh. Oh, there's another one there. Come on, grab it. Oh, man. Oh, I couldn't even see where I was going. I'm trying to collect these things, but... I'm just going to fall, aren't I? There, got it. <laughs> Just barely. There was another one, but I can't even get back up there now, I don't think. Are you thinking about getting this one, Luigi? I'm playing it actually on Game Pass right now. I would have bought it anyway, but having Game Pass, it's like, why the heck not? We gotta, ooh, crap, burn these guys. Oh yeah, fire does a ton of damage to them. Oh no! Oh, I thought the healing dropped off. Oh, I see. My health is at the very top left. It's like those little punch symbols. So I could use just a little bit more. Now we should be filled up. Oh, you've been working through it the past couple days? How are you liking it so far? This is my first time even trying it. So far, I'm digging it quite a bit. I bet we can reach that with a double jump. Just barely. Hurry up, darling. We need to keep moving. Oh no, I missed that thing. Can I let go and do it again? You can. Okay, good. Let's see if I can reach that. Jump back here. I'm not sure how long that balloon lasts. It's got to be on one of these corners of the screen, I guess. You are really enjoying it? It's just so... I don't know. It's like you're watching them really well animated movie or something. I love the style, the graphics, the humor. And the characters. Really Mia, cool the characters. mission is falling apart. We've lost control of Lobato. There's a little chaos on every mission, Raz. A psychonaut must always remember how to roll with it. You remember how to gather your thoughts and roll with them, right? Roll? Gotta roll your arms. And you can press left trigger on the ground to use levitation. Whoa! That's cool. It's like we're on a... Balancing on a ball or something. I feel like we move really fast doing that. Hey, what is that thing right there? I don't know exactly what that is. But I feel like if I can figure out what it is, I can make it to that bag tag. Does it have something to do with this bowling roll? Oh, the size of the balloon. It shrinks as it goes down. That makes a lot of sense. 
Does that have anything to do with it? Oh, nope. Sure doesn't. <laughs> I had to test that out. Maybe this is one of those things you have to get a new ability and then come back to this level and then you can do that. However, I want to test out a theory if I can just like float my way down there. Even. Oh, no. Oh, don't fall. Ah, it's too late. I want to try just like balancing myself on this. Can I even reach up there? Without falling? My gosh, it's hard to do that. Let me try walking up the side. I want to get as close to the edge as I can and then try to glide my way to that item. You can tell these areas were not made for you to walk. Oh no! Oh, I miss it. Oh, no worries at all, Luigi. Uh, what are you playing right now? Okay. See it. Let's go for it. Jump. But double jump. Oh. That didn't last at all. I think it's the game is telling me no, John. That's another death. You're not supposed to do that, but I'm going to try it one more time because I'm a glutton for punishment. There we go. What if I follow the path with these dots? Maybe then it'll work. Oh, Apex Legends. I haven't actually played that yet. Oh yeah, it just immediately dies. So you have to use their way to get that. All right, let's drop down here. Oh, so that's why we need levitation. We can get past these hazardous floors. Okay, can we attack while I'm levitating? Not really. You can run into things, but you can't really attack. Oh, it looks like there's something over there, but maybe not. Whoa! Oh, that was cool. Missed one of those items. I'm going to try to get most of them, but I'm not going to kill myself to get all of them. We probably have to get through this fast with levitation. They seem to be those type of teeth that fall down when you walk on them. Nice. Mia, where are you? Sasha, I can't reach Mia. I think she's been dementistrated. What? <laughs> dementistrated? Coach. Lily? Oh no. I think I'm the last one still in here. There's another tag back here. So you are able to go back if you want to? Oh, so you can kind of redo levels just to kind of collect everything? That's good to know. And I, I imagine you kind of have to if you want to collect everything. Because I could have sworn like that, those white circles on the screen. There's like some new ability you need to utilize them to travel, but I just don't have it yet. So when you get that, you can come back here and I guess get the things you missed because you weren't able to. This is a neat looking level. Look at that. I like that crescent moon. It's like all jagged and bizarre looking. Let's see here. I guess I'll just wait till the other side. And now, just barely. There we go. What was I uh -oh. to do again? Getting close. It's him, I've got to stop him. No. no. Oh, there's like little ones too. That's kind of cool. The controls in this game feel great. The combat, the dodging and everything feels a lot more fluid, I think, than the original games did. And the original game played well, but 
Things have gotten faster, smoother. They put the box in the basket and the basket in the ocean. No, that's not it. I put the whole egg in the box and the basket in the cake. Uh-oh. <laughs> They're getting me on these platforms, too. Okay, I only have one third of my health left. I put the whole box in the basket and the egg in the ocean. I put the egg in the box and the... No, no. The heck is he talking about? Put the egg in the box, put the box in the ocean? Box. I put... I put the whole egg in the box and the basket in the egg. <laughs> He's losing his mind. I need some healing. I put the basket. I put the egg in the box and the box in the basket and the basket in the ocean. No, no. That's not it. Put the old box in the basket and the egg in the ocean. You put the egg in the basket and the old egg in the box and the box in the ocean. <laughs> Simple. And if you tell anyone about me, anyone at all, you'll have to deal with her. No, not her. Please don't make me look at her again. So that's the boss, no, huh? No, I won't tell. I won't tell anyone. I promise. No, please. Ah! Whoa. <laughs> Who is that? That was pretty cool. Oh, thank you, Luigi. That's good to know. No, not her. I won't tell. Oh, everyone's waking up. The heck? That bozo's brain was booby trapped. Yes, whoever hired Lobato to kidnap Truman knew he might be psychically interrogated. The poor thing looks terrified. Did anyone get a good look at his boss? Just a shadow. I saw him, but I couldn't tell who he was. And I saw something else. I saw the thing that terrified Lobato. It was a woman. Dressed in black fur. She was floating over the ruins of a city, and she was commanding serpents of water. There was something familiar about her. Hmm. Rasputin, I'm going to show you a picture. That's, That's her! It. Wait a second. I thought I recognized her. True Psychic Tales, issue 43. It's a comic She's character. She's on the cover. Maligula. The deluge of Grulovia. Maligula? She's been dead for 20 years! Ford Crawler killed her himself! A battle from which he never truly recovered. She was a monster. A ruthless, power-hungry psychic who drowned hundreds of her own countrymen. Nevertheless, she still has her loyal followers to this day. This file documents recent activity believed to be the work these modern-day delusionaries. What are they up to? Well, it's ridiculous, really. There's no scientific basis to... Necromancy. What? I They're love necromancy. They're trying to bring her back to life? It's silly, darling. But if they believe they can do it, they might do some dangerous things. Mia, have you considered the other disturbing fact in all of this? That unstable character. Could Beat never it. kidnap the grand head Get of the lost. Psychonauts without help? Yes. You mean... There's a mole in the Psychonauts. Uh-oh. You think this is a mole, you're dumber than you look. Approaching <laughs> the mother lobe. Clever. Not a mole, it's a squirrel. The mother lobe. It was a really pretty game. They did a good job. I don't think I've ever seen these people before. 
Like from the previous game? Maybe I have. I don't know. Oh, good luck, Luigi. Hope you kick some butt. Hopefully I get a good teammate, too. I think it's your pairs in that Agent game, right? Forsyth, why did you deny us intel when we hailed the Motherlobe? What are you talking about, Agent 9? We were on a mission to rescue the Grand Head of the Psychonauts. When we called for assistance... I never heard any call. Who did you talk to? Is he all right? We won't know for sure until we get that squirrel tested for rabies. This is our kidnapper. Clearly, he had help on the inside. Clearly. Impossible. A mole in the Psychonauts? We have reason to believe delusionists are involved. And they're trying to bring back Maligula. What? I know. Isn't it great? The Psychonauts haven't had this kind of a threat in years. Can someone help me with my dad? He's still acting funny. Truman! I think he was kidnapped in the VR game. Let's get him inside so he can lie down. It's been a while. Forget these I'll details. See what I can find out in my meditation chamber. I'm taking Lobato to my office for further interrogation. I'm gonna talk to Otto about our military options. Does that make anyone else a little nervous? Who are you? I'm Whoa. Raz. Uh, Rasputin? I'm, uh, your newest psychonaut? How's that? If Ford Crowley, he gave me a badge. I've been kind of helping out. <laughs> Listen, kid. Agent Crowler is a hero. But he's not operating at 100%. He can hand out all the merit badges he wants, but he doesn't have the authority to commission psychonauts. But you can, right? You're Hollis Forsyth, lesser head of the psychonauts? True Psychic Tales 146. You and Truman fought the Noodler together. I prefer the title, Second Head. If the other agents vouch for you, I might be able to get you a spot. In the intern program. Aww. But don't be late for orientation. I hear the coordinator's a real brain buster. Welcome to the mother lobe. Here we thought we we're all high and mighty doing great. Nah, now we're trying to get to be an intern. <laughs> we just got knocked down a peg. <clears throat> hey, is it okay if I go up into the main headquarters now? I'm sorry, little boy, but there just aren't any school tours today. What? I'm an intern. Agent Forsyth <laughs> gave me this. <laughs> We're an intern Hurry now. Up. Let's check your head in the thinker print reader, please. Uh oh. Well, I'll be doused. Welcome to the intern program. Let me get you your orientation materials. Oh, gosh. I've never been an intern at any place before. Tiny phrases. Thank you so much for the sub 23 months. Holy crap. I love that, Tiny. Time is rigged. How are you doing, Tiny? Time zones, man. Time zones are absolutely bonkers drop some tokens in there what is new tiny how are you doing it's like already friday for you right i guess it's technically almost friday for me in 30 minutes but you're like in the middle of your friday right or just getting up or something um we just beat the medium about an hour or so ago and we're starting this brand new game psycho knots 2 i'm really digging it so far oh nice catch tiny okay welcome to the intern program this field manual will act as your guide through the world of Psychonauts. Your progress is tracked here along with the information you gather on your journey to becoming a junior Psychonaut. When in doubt, press the, whatever the hell button that's called, menu button, to consult your manual. I never know what the Xbox controller buttons are. These ones on the side right there. Like, I always just want to call them start and select, but like, that's not really what they call them anymore. So you're doing good. You just had breakfast and you're going to go shower. I'll be right back after all. We'll see you in a little bit. Tiny, thank you again so much. <laughs> we did beat it. Your skepticism was misplaced. Amazingly, we knocked it out. Oh no, Luigi, how far did you get in the rankings there? It's one of those battle royales where you start with like 100 players and they get knocked out until there's only one, right? 
Oh, we have an intern profile. Your internship progress is tracked on this page. Intern rank is key to unlocking new psychic abilities. Increase your rank by finding Psy challenge cards and markers in the real world or nuggets of wisdom in mind, which I don't know if we found any nuggets of wisdom. We found all different kinds of things in that brain, but no nuggets. Wow. <laughs> the nuggets. That picture really captures my startled side. <laughs> Age 10, height 4'4". Four, four. I love his name, Rasputin Aquato. Oh, this is neat. We can look at all the items we have. Our intern name tag. I'm not a full-fledged psychonaut yet, but this badge makes me a member of the official intern program. What about this? Our Psy Portal. A trusty Psy Portal in, is my pocket-sized door to the mental world. I guess this is how we get into people's brains. Oh, no, your friend was grabbing a drink and you got ambushed. That sucks. And he really can't take much of a break in those games, huh? Psy Powers. This is the next tab. This section of your manual tracks the progress of any Psy Powers you are authorized to use while in the intern program. As your rank increases, you will earn intern credit, which you can spend here for Psy Power upgrades. Use, use of the unauthorized powers is strictly prohibited. Looks like I can choose where to focus my energy and upgrade my powers. Oh, I love interest. upgrade trees. Um, what I want to upgrade first. Oh, I guess I don't have any credits available. I can't do anything yet. <laughs> Need some more points. Never mind. The area survey. As a psychonaut, it is important to always be aware of your surroundings. This section of the manual tracks your exploration in both the physical and mental worlds. Gotta keep track of all the places I've been here. So just everybody's brain that we invade, I guess. So brains, we've been in Lobatos and places, the mother lobe. Mission Log. The Mission Log tracks any official Psychonaut missions you undertake as part of the intern program. Consult this section for active missions and key operating procedures. I'll keep my to-do list here. Let's see. So our curtain mission is report to the classroom. Hollis Forsyth wants me to report to the intern coordinator in the classroom. The map I got at reception should help me find it. There's a lot to this little manual. That's kind of cool. So I can press this to go to this menu at any time. Not sure how to bring out the map. Was it in here? Oh, maybe... Oh, here's a map. So where are we? I think we're where it says number one right there. Um, and we'll just kind of explore rather than try to master the map right now. I love that map, though. It's like so retro style. It looks really neat. Yeah, I got to say, this game is running so much better on my computer than the medium did. I definitely struggled from time to time. Okay, so we're ready to go out this way. So, Luigi, is that your favorite Battle Royale game right now? Apex Legends? There's so many now, but like the big ones like Fortnite... I guess uh, Call of Duty one. Um, and what else? There's one other one too that's pretty big right now. I guess PUBG is always there. Yeah, so I played the first one back in 2005 when it first came out. I think I played it on the original Xbox, actually. And then I played the VR one on the PlayStation VR when that first came out. Am I supposed to use this? Oh, it's like a door. Granted. <laughs> it's so clever. Thinker print. What is this? Oh, that's a loading screen. Gee, what a violent elevator. Wow. I can't believe I'm really here. Psychonauts headquarters. The hell? Wow. <laughs> it's like a hamster ball with a brain. 
Doesn't that helmet get in the way of your mental waves? Agent? Hello, stranger. Okay, remember you... Oh, I didn't miss that, but... Try to give me a hint. Can I just talk to everybody? Maybe just certain people. Oh, this looks so cool. There's so much going on. Greetings, fellow psychic. I'm Otto Mentalis. I'm personally too busy crafting the future of psychotechnology in my lab right now. This automatic has all the psychic supplies and enhancements you need. Let nothing finish. The side challenge card. Sometimes you'll find these bits of old side challenge markers flopping around. If you bring a bunch to automatic, you can combine it with a core to gain a whole rank. I don't know what that gets me, but why not? So is Warzone the big battle royale right now? But you like Apex, though, because you think a character-based BR is pretty neat. Kind of like Overwatch or something, Attention how that's character-focused, I guess. If you do not have a mentor yet, please report to my office immediately for assignment. Uh oh we have to get assigned a mentor, too. Here's Automatic. This is your one-stop shop for Psychonaut supplies, pins to mod your Psy powers, and Psy challenge markers creation. Let me give you a dime tour. Have a look around. Right now we can only look at these items right here. Items are the goods no Psychonaut can do without. Be sure to stock up on supplies before heading out on missions. When you save up enough Cytanium, consider grabbing some accessories to upgrade your carrying capacities. Let's see. This is where you can pick up Psy Challenge Core. There's so many different items and things in this game. Why don't you grab a complementary core for yourself? We'll use it in the next section. Yoink. I like free stuff. Idea. Let's make a Psy Challenge marker and get you ranked up. Okay, then press B to go to the other menu. Now I go to here to the combine thing. So I have a couple cards. I guess I combine the cards with that core to do something. So it is kind of like Overwatch was made into a battle royale. That's a neat idea. I dig that. Especially if it's well balanced, you know. You'll need nine side cards to use with that side core you got. I don't have nine cards. You can combine the whole lot of them to create a side challenge marker, which will grant you one rank. I'll spot you nine cards to try it out. Well, thank you. Never mind. We're already good to go. Okay, let's combine that. We got that ranked up. I don't know what this does for me. Okay, so we're ranked two now. Last but not least, feast your eyes on these pins. So this modifies our psychic abilities? Pins allow you to add custom tweaks to your psi powers. You can mix and match them to your style of play. And as you rank up, you'll gain access to more powerful ones. Why don't you try out, uh, or why don't you try one out on the house? Pick one of these three levitation pins. Yes, I'm currently playing the PC version. I'm using Xbox Game Pass, so I, I downloaded it through the Microsoft Store, but I am playing on PC, but I am using a controller, because, I don't know, I could use keyboard and mouse, but platformers feel so much better with a controller. Oh, so this is just, like, graphics customization, huh? I just get to pick what color of things I want. I do like blue. Let's go ahead and do that. Are you sure you want this? Yes. Buy and equip. Wise choice. I don't think that did anything besides the color. So much cool stuff in there. I'll come back later. The so now if I do this, yep, I got a blue ball. That's cool. Wow. Here they are. The Psychic Six. The group of paranormal experts Ford Crowler gathered together to form the Psychonauts. I read all about them in True Psychic Tales, number one. <laughs> Tragically, Nerd. none of them were the same after fighting Maligula in the deluge of Grulovia. Less tragically, but still upsetting. My mom used that issue of True Psychic Tales to line the floor of the world's smallest horse tree. Oh no. <laughs> Did you see the way Agent Forsyth stormed through here? If she doesn't find a way to let off some steam soon, she's going to crack. She needs a vacation. Hey, don't we all? That's pretty sweet looking. Um, when you played the game, what did you play on Luigi? I think you can get it on everything except for Switch. I don't think it's on Switch. Astral Lanes. Is there bowling? Wow! A bowling alley? That's a cool. A psychic bowling alley? Amazing! Bowling's it doesn't fun. Doesn't look open though. 
I'm not any good at bowling, but I always enjoy it. I'm happy if I break Excuse 100. Excuse me, but do you know where intern orientation is? Second floor, past the classroom. Thanks. If you pass the restrooms, you went the wrong way. What, are we recruiting from kindergartens now? Hey. <laughs> I mean, we are like 10. We're not in kindergarten, but still, we're really young. Scanning for fingerprint. Oh, no. That's going to take me back down. I don't want to do that. Okay, I should probably just go straight to the classroom. I bet everything else is mostly locked down. There are so many things to check out, though. Oh, there's another card. Got a side card. Oh, you look just like my nephew. A little jerk. Oh. Hello. Ah. <laughs> Aggressive. With this convenient automatic, there is no need to bother me in my lab. I'm busy. Welcome to the auto. Okay, so it's always the same thing. They're just kind of no all over the place. Refunds. Hey, look out! Oh, sorry, I didn't. Whoa! Ow! That's mean. Did he hurt you, baby? I'm not a baby. Yeah, you are. Question is, who's this new kid? My name is Raz, and I'm the new intern. Oh, that's ridiculous. I didn't ask for a new intern. Intern program's full. Sorry, kid. He is clumsy. He'd probably get us all killed. And he's mean. Well, kid, we give it a fair shot, and it looks like it just didn't work out. Better luck next year. <laughs> That's a fair shot. Quit picking on the new kid. We were all new once, in case you forgot. I think he'll fit in just fine. In fact, I think he'll look cute in our uniform. Let's take him to the closet. Hey, you okay in there, Rusty? What's the holdup? Nobody else is wearing a uniform. It's Raz. I was just wondering, if there's an intern uniform, how come you guys aren't wearing it? Oh, well, Question. we're level two. Now just hand out your clothes and we'll get you that uniform. It's gonna look Can't ridiculous. Can't you hand me the uniform first? <laughs> no, silly. We need to take your clothes and measure them so we can get you a uniform that fits. Don't do it. Unless you want us to come in there and measure you. No, no. Here you go. Just hurry up, okay? It's cold in here and I'm practically naked. Oh, that's messed up. Guys? What it's like to be the new guy. Oh, come on. This is embarrassing in so many ways. Poor Raz. Um... So you're playing on Xbox One. It has some troubles running. It's crashed twice, but you are enjoying it. So yeah, on PC, um, when I first ran the game, it gave me a warning. It said that I had an old graphics driver and there's known issues. So far, it hasn't crashed or anything. I did notice some weird glitching on the floor textures just a few minutes ago. Otherwise, it's running real smooth. Um, I haven't updated my graphics driver in a while, but I am gonna install a new video card in my computer tomorrow. So when I continue this game later, hopefully won't have any of those issues. So do I still have all my abilities? Oh yeah, I can still burn stuff. Oh yeah, there's something behind there. Sweet. Oh, and there's another card up there. All kinds of stuff to find. Now, are you playing on the original Xbox One? I still have the original that came with like the, uh, oh, what was it called? The Kinect, the camera thing. You can't even get that anymore, but my Xbox One I bought back in 2013 had that thing. Hmm, there's a narrow slot, but I don't think I can fit through it. Oh, that might be a way out, but too small. Yep. I guess I... I should be breaking everything because it seems like some stuff gives you some cash. There we go. I never got the Xbox One S, which I think ran a little bit better, but I, I did get the Series X fairly recently. Oh, I can't break those. I don't have a key. 
supply chest. Agents stash surplus resources in all sorts of places, just in case. They're yours for the taking if you have the supply chest key. Oh, so you have probably the original one too, yeah. Oh, there's like a little hole down there. I wonder if I can crawl in there. I don't know the code. Rats! Oh, sorry, Harold. You're absolutely right. I should think about how I'm using that word. <laughs> yes. What is it, Harold? Do you I love know the it. code? Is the code in there, Harold? I'm too big to go in there. So cute. If only I could see what you see in there. Hey, that reminds me. The only thing that's too big to fit in there is his huge head. That noggin is not getting in there. So we have clairvoyance as well. It lets you see through the eyes of other people or animals. Using it on anyone displaying the eye aura can reveal hidden information about the world. Use it to find the door code. Okay, before I take them over, let's make sure we get all the goodies. Aha! Uh -huh. I'll bet this key goes to that supply chest I found. Okay, let's let's try to do that before we leave this place. Hey, got some cash. I don't know how much that was. So we actually have a maximum. We already have 59 out of 100. We have to find some way to uh, spend it before we get too much. Okay, so we want to equip clairvoyance and equip it to a button. I only have four. Which one do I want to get rid of? I think maybe the grab... Function? I don't really use that a ton. Not right now, anyway. Time to see the world as you see, Carol. Yes, yeah, so it would probably run perfectly on the Series X as well. Zero seven two six. I love how he looks like a giant rat. Oh, I'm actually playing. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? I'm actually playing that big, like, cut-out rat thing. That's awesome. That's how the rat sees us. Oh, I didn't even have to remember it. I just did that. Yeah, see how the floor is glitching right there? I think that's because of my video card drivers. Honestly, with my current video card, it probably... I, my computer is a bit more powerful than the Series X, but when I install my new graphics card, it'll be vastly more powerful, so then we shouldn't have any issues at all. Wait, which way am I shimmying? There we go. Uh, oh no. <laughs> oh, poor Raz, look at this. Go before anyone sees you. Let's see, there's something about truck drivers are supposed to go on strike on Tuesday the 31st. Is that a real thing, Luminous? Tell me anything. I hadn't heard anything about that. Is that, that might be a local thing to where you're at or a particular trucker union. I'm sure there's tons of different unions of truckers. I, I don't know much about it, but uh, oh, that could be crazy. That could definitely cause uh, some issues with supplies of stuff locally for sure. got him right where we want him and yet we still can't extract the information we need have you tried the corpus colossorator of course no effect deep lobe trepanator it put him to sleep i don't know what it is but something about these flashing lights is very soothing that was the first thing i tried no use it looks really cool oh i bet clairvoyance should be a lot of fun Sasha, you have to let me do more. You know it's because of me that... Otto. I mean, if I hadn't... Oh, crap. Oh, no, he took a picture for us almost Not naked. Not a word, Rasputin, until I find you some new clothes. Sorry, hey, the is a look at that. The, the smallest clothes I had. Now, uh, tell us again how you ended up outside in your underwear. Oh, you know, I, I was sort of going undercover. 
Just like you did, Agent Mentalis, in True Psychic Tales number 62, when you used your defibrillator to hypnotize 16 trans troopers at once. Oh, please. That old yarn. <laughs> oh, they embellished so many Thank details you for the alert, in tiny. the version. But in fact, it was 17 troopers. Well, love to chat, but uh, I gotta make like a brain and bounce. It's cool how all of these characters are like his hero. If you're looking for just the right tool for the job, come see me in my workshop. Even the best psychonauts require a little assistance now and then. Now, if you'll excuse me, Rasputin, I need to get back to the matter at hand. No, no. I didn't bend the spoons, mommy. <laughs> Poor Lobato. Ooh, I love going through the car wash. Oh, and don't worry car washes are fun. Speaking of the video cards. Luminous. Oops. I will be installing this guy in my computer probably tomorrow morning. Let's see if you can see this. It might be kind of blocked out because it's green and it's reversed. <laughs> but that's a 3080 Ti. So excited to get that installed tomorrow and play around. I'm going to be able to use the spare parts because I have a video card and power supply on my current computer that's missing in my old one. I'm going to be able to rebuild my old computer, essentially, with the decent graphics card I have right now and uh, have a second desktop in my office so when my wife plays with me, she can use that and she doesn't have to use my laptop, which struggles in some games. Over one of my lights. Let me... Seriously, it took... Quite a while, Luminous, to get that. Oh no, I got it MSRP. I actually got it, it's like a bundle, unfortunately, but fortunately, I can use everything in the bundle. It came with a power supply, which I needed to rebuild the other computer. It came with a keyboard, which my wife could use a new keyboard, and it came with uh, three months of Xbox Game Pass, which I'm already using anyway. That's actually how I'm playing this game right now, is through Game Pass. So it was all MSRP, just bundled, but with some things I can actually use, which is nice. Not like a motherboard I don't need or anything like that. Yeah, that's a pretty beefy video card, Luigi. It's one of the top of the line ones, so it should run everything great. It's so hard though. You know, Luminous, the way I got lucky is somebody in one of those YouTube channels that kind of um, monitors when things go live. People in the chat were saying that they had bundles at, it's called Ant Online, which is not a, people, not a lot of people know about the website, but they're legit. And I actually bought speaker equipment. I recently just, few months ago bought uh, my new home theater system speakers from them so I already knew about the website checked it out they had like two bundles left I think they had like a 3080 and then the 3080 Ti and I think the 3080 came with something I wasn't really gonna ever need so I went ahead with the other one it wasn't that much more con considering how big the difference is for other bundles so that worked I was very happy about that but yeah the, the market's so terrible for trying to get that kind of stuff Uh, thanks, Sasha. Hey, what was he saying? <laughs> I missed some of that. Hi. Hey, little agent. If you would just cooperate with our investigation. Oh, he's talking about to Lobato still. I know you're scared, but if you could just oh, it's, tell uh... me who... No, 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 no more question. What's her name? Is this a bad time, Mia? Mia. I always have time for my kid in genio. see oh so many things to ask are you worried about maligula are you worried about maligula well she died in the bottle of grulovia but sometimes the idea of someone is more dangerous than the person themselves her followers are what scare me when someone devotes their life to a memory they're capable of anything it's kind of funny when i was playing the medium earlier today we beat that game on stream earlier my computer struggled with my current video card playing that game. It's probably not the most well-optimized game, but still, it's like I couldn't turn on RTX, and even without that, it struggled during certain scenes. So it'll be nice to try to get rid of that problem with the new hardware. Are you meditating? Are you meditating? In a way, I'm reaching out to detect ripples in the psychic network around the world. 
<laughs> Why? What are you doing that for? I'm trying to find the illusionist activity around the world and report it to Agent Forsythe down in the nerve center. Oh, the medium. It's a pretty sweet kind of a horror game where you play. I kind of picked Psychonauts because in the medium you also play like a psychic. But in that game, you can talk to like the spirit world. And sometimes you have to play two different games at the same time almost. It's like the game goes like split screen, left and right, sometimes up and down. And you're controlling a character in the real world and also a character in the spirit world simultaneously. And you have to solve puzzles by going back and forth. And if one area is blocked, then neither one can pass. You have to kind of figure that out. It's pretty sweet. Ripples, you say? Ripples? A name like Maligula carries heavy emotional baggage for many people. It's like a large stone dropped in a pond. Ripples spread out, bounce off each other. If you know how to read the patterns, they can lead you to the source. Hmm. And Psychic Six? Can I ask you about the Psychic Six? Of course, Rasputin. <laughs> Are any of them still around? I thought we actually met one of them. I, I dug it a lot, Luigi. It wasn't exactly what I expected. I thought it was going to be more of a survival horror game where, you know, you, you might have weapons, you got to fight things. There was no fighting at all. There's a little bit of stealth. You could get killed and a little bit of running, but it was mostly a puzzle game, which I really liked. Are any of them still around? Oh, yes. Besides Ford, you know, there's Otto Mentalis out in his workshop, still tinkering with his gadgets. Sasha is his number one customer. We met Otto. Dogen Bull's grandfather, Compton, is here as well, but he... he keeps to himself. The other survivors have gone their own ways, unfortunately. So nobody's dead, just some of them have scattered. What about Helmet Fullbear? What happened to... Helmet Fullbear? Oh, that poor soul was lost in the Battle of Grulovia. I wish I could have met him. He seemed to have such a love of life and color. I love their facial expressions. They did a good job with the animation. Did you ever meet Cassiopeia? No, but I read her book, Mindswarm. Very inspiring. I'm actually using some of her multitasking techniques right now, talking to you while I work. <laughs> what is she doing? Is she even paying attention to us? Um... And Bob Zanotto. Did you ever work with Lily's great uncle, Bob Zanotto? Oh, yes, poor Bob. He lost so much in the battle. It really took a toll on him. I know it was very difficult for Truman to let him go, but it was getting dangerous. Oh, what that poor family has endured. Well, enough about those guys. Yes, let's talk about us. <laughs> Something much more interesting. How about Truman? Are you worried about Truman? To be honest, I've never seen him like this before. But he's very tough, and he has his fearless daughter in there now, taking care of him. Yeah, it's kind of neat, Luigi. Like, most games that we think of being having great graphics are usually very realistic. You know, you think of, like, The Last of Us or something like that. And yeah, they, they do look great. Fantastic. But you kind of always think those are the highest-end games. But when you get a game like this... It has a much more artistic style, but still high, high quality graphics. It just looks so cool. I love it. Monkey, are you playing some Tetris Effect right now? How about Sasha? Have you talked to Sasha lately? Sasha and I are always talking. Oh, he says hello. <laughs> With their minds. Well, I'll stop bothering you now. Never a bother, darling. Ciao. That it does, Monkey. When I first played Tetris Effect, it was in VR on the PlayStation when that first came out. and That just blew my mind. So cool. And the PlayStation VR, that's like the worst of all the VR headsets, and it still looked great. It's just kind of low resolution. Hey, kid. Making copies or something. Which uh, VR headset do you uh, want to try to get, Monkey? Anything in particular? Or just anything you can get your hands on? That was a dirty trick you pulled. I want my clothes back. Jerk. You know you're right. I'm sorry. And I'm going to make it up to you. I'm going to let you finish my asset recovery mission. 
Why do I feel like I'm gonna end up naked in a closet again? How does that help me? My intern assignment is to track down this list of missing psychonaut assets. Mission critical assets. So, like a scavenger hunt? If you think like a child, you will do a child's work. Finish this mission, and we'll know you're ready for your clothes back. Not cool. Not cool at all. You know, Monkey, like I always give this suggestion. Some people want to save up and get the Valve Index. That's what I use. It's really nice. It has a lot of cool features, but it is so expensive for what it is. Um, in a lot of ways, it is the creme de la creme of VR headsets. But honestly, if, you know, money is a factor and you want to save some money, if you don't mind integrating your Facebook account with your VR headset, those Oculus Quest uh, headsets, they're fantastic for the price. You, you, they're way cheaper than the other ones. Of course, they're taking all of your <laughs> personal information as Facebook does. But I mean, what do we have to hide unless you're dealing drugs or something? So, yeah. You could uh, totally save a lot of money and get one of those things. You can create a Facebook account, but I think they check to make sure there's like no fake Facebook accounts connected to things. So you should create it with a real name and everything. You don't have to make it public or anything where people can find you, but you should create a legit Facebook account if you do get one of those. So if someone has an eye symbol above their head, you can use the clairvoyance. Oh, I remember the mention in that, Luigi. Thank you. Oh, so this is an optional mission, not part of the main thing. Your internship will sometimes present you with extra credit opportunities. You can track these optional missions here. This looks like a good place to track my side missions. I like that. Extra credit, because, like, we're in school. Let's see, did I already... Oh, I see some cash in here, looks like. Yep. There we go. Oh, like... This guy right here has it. He sees me like some kind of spy. It's just fun moving around when they see you as something else. It's so weird. Like, why do we even look like that? I don't know. Oh, what is this? Oh, sweet. I have this weird urge to go shopping. Oh, we're approaching the Citanium Max Capacity. Visit Automatic to find your wallet upgrades and increase your capacity. Oh, sweet. Kind of reminds me of Zelda. Got to get the bigger bag. Hold more rupees. Oh, there's something up here, too. Was that always there? Or did I just miss it because I wasn't using this view? Okay, I think we're done. So we have to find one of those automatic vending machines and get a bigger oh, wallet. Gross. Don't do that. Friends have to drink that water. Hey, Sam. Aren't you not supposed to tap the glass? No, it's the opposite. You're supposed to tap on the glass to keep their heart rates up. <laughs> I don't think that's how that works. In this predator-free environment, their heart rates get dangerously slow. Huh. Plus, they love it. I mean, look at them jump. <laughs> <laughs> They're freaking out, man. Poor fish. Don't be lazy. And I haven't played a platformer in feels like a long time, but I guess I did hey, do Crash Bandicoot not that long ago. Hi. It's very different than this, though. I mean, this is like a full exploration-based game. Oh, we're totally maxed out. Yeah, let's go find one of those things. <laughs> those square bushes remind me of Minecraft. I'm really late to intern orientation now. I better get to the class right away. Okay, let's go ahead and use that this thing. Aura is telling you their perspective on the world is oh, especially worth really? seeing. these new pins, the very latest. Okay, so is it under items, I guess? Oh, here we go, a Cyfold wallet. This physically enhanced accessory harnesses folding technology to store loads more Citanium. So right now we have a max of 100. What is it after this? Done. Oh, that's the Sold. hot stuff right there. A thousand. Holy crap. Yeah, that was worth it. Whenever you need more gear, the automatic will be here. So, where did I come from? Was it this agent's area? You can see, I think I left some of those things up here. I couldn't pick it up. I was too full. Agent, 
There we go. Okay, now we definitely have to go to that classroom. We got waylaid last time. This way. Oh, let's see more goodies. Intern. Agent. Intern. <laughs> Intern agent. Let's see, there was somebody, I think they mentioned with a eye above their head. I don't see where they are. What's going on? Nothing. Don't worry about it. There are a lot of people though. Is that the classroom right there? That's the noodle bowl. Oh, I was going the right way. So they don't share the top. Yeah. Hey. Hi. Hey, cutie. We could talk to her earlier. It's just not safe to use clairvoyance without my special clairvoyance enhancing bins. It said Raz can climb on vines. Is it talking about these right here? Oh, wait. No. I can't leave this card lying around. Yes, we can climb in these. Okay, that's how I had to get that card. Mario Odyssey, Luigi. That game was amazing. That might be one of my favorite 3D platformers ever. Like I, Mario games are always fantastic, but Harold, Harold, has Lily ever talked to you? About really enjoyed Mario Odyssey. Forget I asked that. The card up there. There we go. Austerity measures, Oleander. Every department Lizzie, is affected. Once I get my pirate radio station going, I'm gonna have a few, not many, DJ jobs open. Oh yeah? What's it pay? A lot. In exposure. Plus, <laughs> you'll get free music appreciation lessons from me. Pass. Never get paid in exposure. Look, I, not worth I really it. need you on the channel. How about a trade? Okay. Switch mentor assignments with me. You take Compton, I get Mia. No one comes between me and Mia, Lizzie. No one. Eh. Did someone say something about pirate radio? No. Yes. Morris is doing it, and it's totally against the rules, and he's going to get kicked out of the Psychonauts. Ruh -ruh. Lizzie, you're fired. Dream on. Can I be a pirate radio DJ? What's your area of musical expertise? Well, I grew up in the circus, so most of what I know is calliope music. I see. Looks like you don't need me anymore, Morris. Listen, I'll get back to you, kid. What is calliope music? Is that what <laughs> you hear in a circus? I don't know. I never heard that term. But my PMVP! No time for pet projects, Maury. You think this is saving you money? Get a hold of yourself, Oleander. Fighting Maligula without my battle bike, cheapskates. Hey, I'm with you. Letting him build a battle anything is probably a bad idea. Hey, <laughs> he's like, heard that. Oh, right, new intern. Thought I told you not to be late. Doesn't matter. You need a mentor. Let me see who's left. Ooh, am I helping Mia? Or Sasha on a mission? No. no. You're in the mailroom. Your mentor is Nick John Smith. Mailroom? John. Nick John Smith? I've never heard of an agent John Smith. Nick's not an agent. He's not even psychic. He's just good at sorting mail. You'll love Nick. Everybody does. But the mailroom? <laughs> Ford Crawler himself worked in that mailroom. You could learn a lot there. For one thing, how to be on time. Hey, we got okay. wrecked by I've the other students. I've given you fingerprint access to the mailroom. Now scoot, I've got a base to run and a budget to balance. Those are really our fault. Hey, rank up. Now we're on three. Let's see, what did that give us? Pins. Every mind is unique. And if you want to customize your psi powers to suit your personal style, you want to get some pins. Find pins in the nearest automatic. We already did one on a test. Oh, that's cool. I'm excited to play more of this, Luigi. Um, the first game I loved, but it was definitely a little janky even at the time. But with new technology and everything, this game feels great to play right now. Hmm. I need more pins. I need all the pins. Okay, so here's where I could do some upgrades. We haven't upgraded anything yet. Hmm. What do I want to upgrade first? 
So everything, we already have rank one. So we're just choosing rank two. So for this one, this is that blast. We can get a bigger blast if we hold the button down. This one lets us fling objects with increased force, deal more damage. And this one lets you press X while dodging to do a dodge attack. That might be pretty cool. I like this one though too. Pyrokinesis burns a larger area. Maybe I'll do that one first. I like that. I know it's only for emergencies, but I really feel like trying out my improved pyrokinesis. I love how it's just like a pin or what you, like a patch you would sew into something. Let's try this dodge attack too. I think that'll be useful. All right. So if you press X while dodging, you will now execute a dodge attack, dealing damage as you exit your dodge. That's fantastic. Ash Williams. How you doing, Ash? It's good to see you. Good morning. For me, it's, I guess it's technically morning. It's 12, 15 AM. I haven't even gone to bed yet, but <laughs> technically it is Friday for me now. What time is it for you, Ash? Oops, there might have been more in the menu. Let me make sure I'm not missing anything. No, I think that was it. So, now we get to be an intern in the mailroom. How illustrious. I think I saw a sign for that. 8.15 in the morning. Good morning to you. You're, you're up earlier than I will probably be tomorrow. Usually I sleep in until like 9, 10 o'clock on my days off. Unless I have something going on and you get up for I just, I stay up too late. I gotta sleep in. Oh, here's the card. 10.15 for you, Therapy. Did you, um, have your second coffee yet, Therapy? My coffee was fantastic. Oh, you still haven't had it yet. Are any of you guys fans of Starbucks? We, Andy and I recently finally got, uh, the pumpkin spice stuff that just came back again. We got those cold brews with the pumpkin spice foam. It's really good. Not too sweet, but it was good. Oh, hey, it's our friend. Hey, uh, how's your dad? Yeah. Terrible. I gotta go get him some therapy plants stacked. Therapy How'd plants? How'd you get that hatch open? Oh, it's got a fingerprint combination. I can teach it to you. Come here. It's more than just a number. You kind of have to feel it. Do you feel it? Oh, we're getting real close. Yes. Good. <laughs> Tell anybody you got it from me, and you're dead. Dang. Bye. Just gave us a dead arm. <laughs> therapy. One brain cell, right? And now we got to find some therapy plants. Let's see. Costa for you? Is that a type of coffee, Ash? What is Costa or Costa? Gonna get some pumpkin spice stuff. They have so many different variations. Like you can get the frappuccino, you can get the hot latte, whatever you want. Okay, so this is like a fast travel, I guess. Right in. Welcome back, dude. It is. Okay, well, I'm still kind of learning the layout, so I'm not gonna fast travel yet. We've been streaming for five hours and 14 minutes. I'm probably not going to go super, super late tonight. I got a lot I want to do tomorrow, building the computer and everything. So I probably won't go till two in the morning, probably one or so. But yeah, we've been on for a long time. Oh, I see another card. <laughs> Tiny. <laughs> we do have some coffee places that I do like their coffee better, but they don't always have like some of the neat, I guess, unique flavors that Starbucks does. So I like to jump around from place to place. Some mentors are telling me that some There's a mail room. Have not yet contacted them for their oh, nice. Contact. What are you watching, Raiden? I won't say anything, but I will soon. Access granted. I say we just got the access. Oh, it's a, a Euro coffee chain. Nice. So what kind of um, coffee do you like to get there? Yeah, we do both, Tiny. Um, just depends on what you want, you know? 
Mr. John Smith? Oftentimes, Hello? Starbucks is if we go late at night, because they have drive throughs and stuff that are open late anyway, so it's the only option. Or if we want something particular, because it's like, you know, a seasonal thing, then often the local places might not do something weird like that, but Starbucks does. I've still never seen Rick and Morty. I got to watch that. Here? Oh, I could do clairvoyance on him. <laughs> look at that. Why do we look like a monster bleeding from the mouth? Unfortunately, I, I couldn't... Um... What's the point of doing this? Sometimes you see things you can't see normally, huh? Oh, yeah, like there's a card up there. Can I reach that? Oh, close. Uh, oh, almost. It's very difficult controlling from this viewpoint. Nice. I think that's why we had to do that. Nice, Ash. Yeah, especially those little places, often they have like some things that are just the best from them, you know? Like, uh, they have some specialty. Nothing beats it. You know, I noticed that, Tiny. Although, I gotta say, it's not always the same worldwide because different countries have different flavors. When I went to Japan, I got this, like, apple something or other, and... My wife got something else with like ginger, I think, and neither one of them you can't get them anywhere else. So they have unique flavors in different countries, but I'm sure if you get a mocha here, it probably tastes like a mocha there, which is what chains are supposed to do. Not very exciting, but. I hope Nick's okay. Oh, how they smell the same. That's probably on purpose, yeah, for sure. Hmm. There's a narrow slot, but I don't think I can fit through. Japan was really cool. I went there for two weeks on our honeymoon, and we really want to go there again. Let it get like this. Once we actually can travel again. Now, this place is huge. Oh, here's the person we're supposed to work with. Who are you? I'm uh, Nick John Smith's new intern. Oh, so you're the one not sorting all this mail. Uh -oh. Wait, better get all this mail sorted quick. You're making Nick look bad. Okay, so we have, what, two different categories? A wrench and what looks like a chemistry vial. How do I know which goes where? I'm just trying to collect all these goodies first. Oh, how do I get in there? Can I move this thing? No. Maybe we can fight our way through here. There we go. Gotta get those keys. I need to sort this mail if I'm going to ace this internship. Japan was just so cool because it was like... It was so foreign to what I'm used to. Like, there's a lot of countries I could have gone to and I've been like, Oh, I, I kind of recognize a lot of these customs and things. But Japan, man, that was like a different planet. So neat. And everybody was so friendly and helpful there. A lot of folks actually spoke English. Okay, there's outgoing. Can I grab any of these? I can't seem to use my psychic ability. Where am I supposed to go? I feel like I need to talk to somebody about my directions. Don't know what that's all about, but we probably have to stop that. Um... Now, when you say optimization, Ash, are you talking about this game in particular, or you just mean in general? Um, I'm currently playing this on PC. I generally try to play everything I can on PC, unless it's an exclusive, of course. And then I kind of play whatever. <laughs> From one project onto the next, Tiny. No, I feel like I can do something here. When I started this game up, Ash, I got a warning that um, my graphic drivers are out of date and I would have some problems. So far, I've only, only noticed like sometimes the ground texture is kind of weird. Other than that, it's been fine. See, I, I can't seem to interact with those things. 
Oh, this incoming thing is completely full. Hmm. I don't really see how to interact with any of these things. Yeah, I bet this game on PS5 is fine. Now, if you're talking about, like, optimization just in general between Xbox and PlayStation 5, the Xbox Series X, I think it's going to depend. There's some things about the Xbox that are a bit better and some things about the PlayStation 5 that are a bit better. I wouldn't be surprised if they maybe spent more time on the Xbox version, though, just because it is Microsoft-owned now. But they, they bought them fairly recently. Hmm, am I supposed to do something with a rat? Oh, look at that. I'm supposed to climb up. I wasn't paying enough attention looking up. I see. <laughs> Here I am, like, there's nothing to do. I just need to get more vertical. That's the funny thing about playing on PC, is it could be not optimized, but if your computer hardware is good enough, you won't even notice. If you're right along the requirements, it might run like crap. I've got enough credit to upgrade one of my side Sweet, a side challenge marker. Finding one of these whole side challenge markers will raise you a full rank. So does that mean I can do an upgrade right now? Wrong button. Yes, another credit. Um. Let's see, I've already done that one. Let's do this flinging does more damage when we pick up items. That's pretty sweet. Honestly, I want to upgrade all these. <laughs> Seriously, Tiny, how are you liking your new computer, by the way? And I, I kind of forgot that they um, made this game. Or sorry, it was a crowdfunded game to begin with. They're not going to have to worry about that anymore now that they got that Microsoft money. Card. I always worry about that when it, a small company gets bought up by a big one. I hope it's just positive for them. I hope they don't get like... Oh, almost didn't make that. I hope they don't get stifled creatively or anything like that because this company does such cool stuff. Can I go through here? It's a dead end. It's running really nice on PC, but I bet it looks just as good on the um, other consoles, of course. The PS5, Xbox Series. I don't think I can go through any of those. What about way up there? I don't really see a way to jump up there. I think that's just like decoration. Alright, so I was really thinking I was going to have to go up here for something. I think it was just for collectibles. Hmm. Oh, crap. I forgot. I changed my abilities. Um, Right trigger used to pick up items. <laughs> I, I swapped it. That, I think that was my problem, Luigi. Um, let me go ahead and switch that back. Where do I where do I do that? Is it here? I think this might be it. So I want the telekinesis. How do I change the mapping? Maybe it's not in this menu. Yeah, there's been a number of double fine games I haven't played, but every one that I've liked has been super charming. Oh, on the D-pad, when I'm on the screen. There we go, thank you. Totally forgot about that. So we already have clairvoyance. I want... Why is that the only one that's clicking to? I already put clairvoyance on the right trigger. Oh, you know what? I was holding it. Is that not my problem? I'm trying to... Sl oh, here we go. This is weird. When I used the... Well, now it's working. When I was using the right trigger, it was like sticking at the bottom. I wasn't sure why. If I use the left trigger, it works fine. Okay, now I can probably pick these things up, right? 
anything? Aha! Got a box. I don't know what this is. Oh, I need to open these things up first. Everything's closed. Or do I shove them up there? No. Yeah, all that she really told me was you need to uh, sort this mail. Not much I can pick up. What other abilities do I have? We got the ball. I got this fire thing. <laughs> you can't burn this stuff. Can we burn this stuff? Can't clear that up. We could do our little shots. That's not doing anything. I can't jump up there. <laughs> Always arson. We're not killing things. We're probably burning things on the stream. And then there's this guy. I don't know what the deal with this is. Probably gonna hurt me if I get too close. Yeah. So how do we slow it down? There might be another ability we get to slow things down. Hmm. There's a narrow slot, but I don't think I can fit through. And I haven't gotten into this office yet. I don't know what the deal with that is. Yeah, I think I might need a hint, Luigi. I've been <laughs> running in circles in this area for a long time. I keep thinking I found something new, and then nope, not really. Something up here I missed? I think this is just the exit. Yeah, we don't want to go that way. We got to figure out how to open up those, I guess, sorting slots. So it is a box at the bottom of the stairs. It got knocked away. Oh, this one? All the, like, labels on it, maybe? Okay, that one has, like, a world on it. Oh, I know what that is. Oh, is that this icon? Aha, okay. Now I got it. Whoops, I just, like, knocked it away and just totally missed it. That has like that hamster thing or whatever that is. Yeah, so each one has kind of a small icon you gotta line up. I'm kind of surprised the game didn't have more tool tips to keep someone as dumb as me from getting stuck for too long. Big package. This package is addressed to Truman Zanotto. Hey, this might be important. Yeah, you see I've the ground textures Truman. warping like that? Technically, this is official Psychonauts business. I'd better deliver this to Truman quick. I'd better deliver this to Truman heavy. What the heck did Truman order here? Okay, this doesn't go in any of those normal ones. Are we just going to walk this to Truman? I mean, I guess I could take it out of here. Ouch. That did some damage. <laughs> Hopefully this is what I'm supposed to do. Come on. Yeah, I can't take it with me. Oh no. What the Hey, the heck is you guys got to check this out. The new kid killed Nick. <laughs> He's alive, but he's brainless. <gasps> what kind of sick monster would steal Nick's brain? I mean, Nick! Maybe he saw something he shouldn't have. But why keep his body alive? And why mail it to the grand head of the Psychonauts? Good question. It could be a warning. Hey, guys. Does the... Lady Lucktopus Casino mean anything to you? Isn't that where we sent Agent 33? Lady Lucktopus? To investigate suspected delusionist activity? 
Agent 33 is two days late with her status update. I'll get the jet. I'll pack the gold case. I'll stay here and protect the children. What? Aren't we all going on the mission? We could use you in tactical command, Agent Forsyth. And maybe the interns would benefit from... It's not safe. Not while we have a double agent among us. I'll take her place. I've heard the buffet there is shockingly reasonable. I do like Vegas buffets. Well, if you reconsider, meet us on the jet pad within the hour. Can't we just... No, all of you, to the intern's bay. Now. Poor Raz. Let me get I've out of here. I've got some training exercises planned today that are both informative and safe. Last one there has to delouse the brain tumbler. I don't know why, but something about her, Hollis. Is that her name? Holly? Hollis? I don't trust. It could be the... TV? Uh... Whoa. It woke up. <laughs> he is brainless. Just wants I'll to watch bet TV. I guys took Nick's body back to the mill. I should go check and see if he's okay. Or we just came my from... Nitro. Access granted. Oh, that guy's our mentor. Okay. Oh, you're going to head out for the night, but you enjoyed the stream. Hope everyone has a good day night. You too, Luigi. Thank you so much for dropping in, hanging out for a bit, and thank you for the follow again. Hopefully we see you again soon. Actually, the next stream on Saturday, I believe, is going to be our community stream. I think that's the last Saturday of the month. So that should be fun. If you can join then, we'll be playing some games together. So you take care, dude. Thank you again for dropping in. Okay, where the hell happened to our mentor? <laughs> Oh, here he is. Why do they wrap him up? There we go. He's still a zombie. No. <laughs> mail. Package. Okay. Air mail. Air mail. I can't do anything with them. I like how he reacts to whatever you do. do not crush, fragile. Oh, do I need to use clairvoyance, maybe? Let me try changing that. Air mail? We look like a little mailman. Postage. <laughs> He doesn't see anything too crazy. It looks fairly normal. Address unknown. It's just so weird how everybody perceives us so differently. It's interesting. Special delivery. Am I supposed to sort more mail? Must sort. I don't think so. It seems Snow. like we're done here. Rain. Still can't get the buffet. We gotta figure out some way of slowing that down. Can't go in this door. I don't know why we had to check on him. All we did was like untie him. But he couldn't like talk to us or anything, so. I guess if I go here, I can look at our current mission. Critical mission is still go to class. I tried to go to class and then they gave me this thing. And then we have the scavenger hunt, so we have to find all the items for her class project. We haven't done that yet. Okay, well, since we just finished that thing, and I do have some things I want to knock out in the morning. We've been going for about six hours. This is probably a perfect stopping point. Let's go ahead and save here. I'm guessing this game just saves all the time. I'm not sure, but I think it should work. So you wanted to go through the first one again before this, but you're playing Hades, Quake, and just got aliens to play with mates. Ash, isn't it so tough? There's just too many games. I thought about streaming the original one too, and I decided against it just because of lack of time, you know? 